Well, it's Tuesday, mm -hmm. and we're, we're bringing stuff down from the attic for the last two weeks. First, we started with some bicycles that you've built from mm -hmm. kids, and then we went into collectible die-cast uh, bicycles mm. that are made by this company. What's the company oh, called? Zyzonics. Zonics. 1991. Almost Don't know that much, of, but yeah, in the 1990s, they did these die-cast one-sixth scale bicycles, mm -hmm. and um, they're highly collectible, and you can oh, find yeah. them on eBay and so on. Needless mm -hmm. to say, they're not in production. No. But um, they're just really fun to find and to collect. Right. So which one do you have this right there? This is the Western Fire. They're all from like 1950. But oh, I love the box work on these. I, my just... favorite bicycles were the yeah. 1950s bicycles. Oh, those, yeah, just your classic bicycle. Some right. of the real early wood rim and stuff. Yeah, mm -hmm. those are interesting, but for just oh. an absolute But they were heavy. jaw-dropping, beautiful bicycle. The mm -hmm. ones from the... Th oh, they were very heavy. Yeah. I had one, which had actually belonged to my mom. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Me too. Mine belonged to my aunt's. But uh, it was really hard to ride because I think the bicycle itself, just with nobody sitting on it, probably weighed around 70 pounds, 100 oh, pounds. Oh, easy. Believe like me, mine fell over on me a few times because uh, I was just learning you know, to ride. So as you were pedaling up the hill, uh, oh my. And it's not like there were <laughs> gear changes or, you No, know. they were single speed. And you, yeah. But they cruised really nice. But boy, do they look neat. And the real ones have become mm. so collectible. And if you don't have room or money for real ones, uh, you might be able to find these they're completely out of production this one needs a repair as well the reflector on the back has come off so we'll every one that. of these has some minor damage mm -hmm. well they were mailed to us and then we've not really done much with them yeah but, uh, this is the cool. western flyer this i love western the black flyer. and white the black and white black and red black and red color scheme that was the color scheme back and it's then got too. the reflectors along the side <sighs> of this the passenger seat there and right isn't that neat? You could wow. give a buddy a ride and yeah. yes. Sometimes we were daring and would sit on these instead of the seat and then try to ride the bike. Been there, done that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but the, you couldn't, you know, reach the pedals was a. Well, it was a yeah. challenge. It was a stretch, but we we did a lot of crazy. You could do stuff. it, but if you yeah. did stick a passenger on, then you really had an unstable mm -hmm. mess on your hands. Right. And, and, uh, but we did all the time, of course. Oh, yeah, and then you can sit even a smaller kid up here on the crossbar, and yeah. Typically, you'd put your junk back here. You'd have your school book. You'd... <coughs> well, you have to edit. <laughs> We're not, I'm not taking that out. I'm not taking out my junk. Your books. <laughs> Let's change the subject rapidly and get back on bicycles. You, your you can put your books, book. <laughs> your biology books, and here. your lunchbox that your had the Roy bucket. Rogers, the Roy Rogers lunchbox, and your books, and that could all be kind of tied down back here, and that's how you got to and from school. And your junk too. <laughs> oh yeah, you got to watch those lockers. You got to watch those lockers. <sighs> Well, that one's that is just gorgeous, yeah, and they have the working chains and yeah, just, isn't that fun? Isn't Whee! that they're just so neat? These die-cast yeah. collectible. Right now, I wish I was a Barbie doll. I'd go for Let's dig out another one. This is the uh, Jetliner. Oh, this is the Startliner. Liner, yeah. yeah. Well, if I can get it to open, it would be the jetliner. Mm -hmm. Just make sure it doesn't really turn into the jetliner. That could be really sad. I like the kickstand. That's just awesome. Yeah, everything about them is really cool. And everything's been stashed in the attic. All uh, the brass engines. We're bringing all the brass engines down and displaying we're those. We're gradually and, finding whatnot shelves and curio cabinets to put them all in. And we've been keeping the curio cabinet companies in. in no kidding, they love us. Doing all this stuff. Oh, now this that is, one's my fave. That's got this the, has got the newspapers for the, if you had your paper route. Yes, but more importantly, it's got uh, something I always wanted on my bike. Other than the paper? Oh, it's got the, the tassels. Streamers. The streamers. I have streamers. And it's got the, the basket. The basket. Wow, look at that. Not, not mounted, but there's no, the basket. Oh, man. It even has a little strap and a little teeny buckle. How about that? Ooh, that's teeny. without breaking anything. Yeah. Always a minor trick. Mm-hmm. 
But uh, check it. it. Look at that. There it is. Now, how come that one got streamers and the girl bike didn't? Yeah. Look at that. They're all multicolored. I mean, they're so fun to have streamers on your bicycle. That is so neat. Yeah. Isn't that cool? Yeah. Very similar bike. They're all very much the same bike with different paint jobs and mm -hmm. different accoutrement and different. Gosh, uh, isn't that cool? But. Uh, this one's missing part of its kickstand. Oh, okay. is it? Hopefully it's in the box. Oh, If dear. not, maybe you can fabricate. You're very good at fabricating Yeah, give things, me some wire so here in a wrench. That'll need to be fixed. Some uh, duct tape. A lot of these things, you know, they get knocked around. And, yeah. And you're buying them used off of eBay because mm -hmm. they're not made anymore. Right. I think these were from an that's estate that's sale. That's mm, memory. So yeah, all my eight-scale motorcycle okay. die casts were off of an estate. A guy had been collecting these. And mm. I wanted to buy the whole collection. I ended up with, I don't know, 10 of them or something. But man, he must have had 50 of them. Mm -hmm. anyway. And then he passed, and they sold off all of his motorcycles. Mm -hmm. But it's the same idea. It there, is. There's these Very collectible similar. die casts. Oh, man. Collecting die cast automobiles and different things. It's a whole it's a whole hobby in and of itself is, is collecting die casts. But collecting these eight scale die casts. These are six scale. Uh -huh. That's an eight scale. A um, little different size. A little different. But these are so much bigger. Mm -hmm. And... Uh, I know that the new scale that, that they're doing with the motorcycles and stuff is quarter scale, mm, which, you know, geez. Geez, could start really those up. big, but uh, mm -hmm. bigger is better, I guess. I guess so. I guess so. Man, I wonder if you could water these and they'd actually grow into a real bike. Wouldn't it be fun to go ride? Well, you know, we've, we've been tempted to buy real bikes, but it's like the world, there's, there's a finite amount of space. Mm -hmm. I forget what the comedian, you know, which comedian it was, but he says, if you owned everything, where would you keep it? That's right. And the answer to that is everywhere. Mm -hmm. So it, it gets complicated. It, it does. It gets complicated. Just having all these little collectibles, my gosh, we don't have right. a, That's why they do Can didn't. you imagine a full-size bicycle collection? That's why our, our storage has looked like the last scene in Indiana Jones yeah. and the, the Raiders of the Lost Ark is yeah. that... And then you, the two you keep of putting get everything away, and then, it, but it's like, you know, having boxes uh, doesn't make any sense. You want to have this on display. So right. we're, we're slowly unboxing the attic, and mm -hmm. anyway, you know the story. Yes. But, um, but there it is. Mm. One six-scale die-cast bicycles, and they're yeah, so that's pretty. That's fun. They, just, look, just really they really neat. look like you could hop on and ride them. Yeah, if you're small enough, you could. <laughs> Well, if you, uh, if you haven't been over to the channel, please pop over to the channel. And if you're not a subscriber, please subscribe. Uh, you can be then notified by setting your notification bell to get all of our wonderful little movies as we upload them and, mm -hmm. and check out our newspapers. And <laughs> um, <laughs> but the way to become a subscriber is to click the blue button. Are we ready, ready for that? <laughs> Zoink! That is the blue button. Oh, yeah. Well, we're not sure how you found this video on the internet. We hope you didn't find it boring, and we will see you here on Sunday as we do something fun and interesting screwing around. We'll see you then. <laughs> see you. Bye-bye.